Alright, who can say? Huh? Are you sure I did? Mr. Wright, we just engaged in a battle of wits. And then the result of that battle, you proved the possibility that I murdered Hammer. Right? But, that is only a possibility. Proof is another thing altogether. You lack decisive proof, Mr. Wright. What? 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 <laughs> Order! Mr. Edgeworth, your thoughts? Uh, uh, humph. Of course, it's as the witness says. Certainly, it does seem very likely she did it, but, uh, there's no proof. Edgeworth isn't sure. Well, I came here as a witness today. If you have no more questions, I'll be leaving. Herc, what do I do now? I, I'd like you to testify again. Testify again? No one to give up, Mr. Wright. Think about it. Even if I were to testify again, what's the point? I can only say what I said before. The truth, Mr. Wright. I've already said all there is to say. What would happen if I said it again? Uh, you'd ask the same questions, get the same answers. A waste of time. Damn. Damn, to come so far only to fail. Rubble, 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 rubble. As it seems there are no further questions, I would like to end the cross-examination of the witness Mr. Vasquez. Yes, Mr. Edgeworth? I was hoping to come up with a question while I was objecting, Your Honor. I didn't. <laughs> I see, very well. Aha! Uh -huh. Your Honor, I request that the witness testify again! You're the prosecutor, are you not? Why are you badgering me? I'm your witness! I, I just want to hear your testimony again. Does this make any sense to you, Your Honor? I don't see what we have anything to gain by repeating the last several minutes. Mr. Edgeworth, I too see little point in making Miss Vasquez repeat herself. What exactly did you want her to testify about? Hmm, well, uh, indeed. Beverly, I say, ergo. I want to hear about what happened after they found the body. After they found the body? Very well. The witness will testify to the court concerning this matter. Hmm. Nick, why did Edgeworth? Who knows? He probably realized she did it too. But, but... Was he the one that says he always gets a guilty verdict? After all that? Edgeworth. Huh. Alright, after finding the body, new testimony. I was with Sal and Old Bank security lady when we found the body. The assistant was there too. Only Powers was absent. I immediately called the police. Then Powers showed up. The security lady, Old Bank, was quite agitated, pointing at Powers, saying he did it. I asked to be left out of the proceedings. I went back to the trailer to get my script and direction notes. Then I went home. Hmm, I see no issues raised by this testimony. Mr. Wright, your cross-examination? Okay, Nick, we're close, real close. She may be acting tough now, but if you put her on the spot, she's sure to falter. Find the key you need and twist the truth out of her, Nick. Right, alright, so we're gonna push again. I was with Sal Old Bank security lady when we found the body. What time was that? We were to meet at 5 for the rehearsal, so I'd say it was then. When exactly did you and Mr. Manella arrive at the studio? About 10 minutes before. I wasn't stuffing any bodies into costumes, mind you. Hmm. Where were the other employees when you got to the studio? They weren't there yet. Well, then you could have put Hammer in that costume with Salmonella's help. Oh? What did I just say? Did I not just say I wasn't stuffing any bodies into any costumes? You should try to listen to what people are saying, boy. Boy? The witness will continue her testimony. The assistant was there, too. Only Powers was absent. Mr. Powers was taking a nap, correct? So he says... Did no one go to call him? Remember. Remember? What? There was a dead body lying in front of us. Yet you expect me to be calm? You certainly seemed calm enough when I accuse you of murder. Sigh. Keep pressing. Wait a second. Wouldn't that be the other way around? The other way around? You discovered a murdered body and one person was missing, right? Wouldn't you normally go looking for the missing person? Hmm. I have to agree with the defense on this one. Well, Miss Vasquez? Huh. Logically speaking, perhaps, but no one there was thinking very logically, I assure you. Also, without his steel samurai costume, Powers doesn't really stand out. We often left him on the bus when shooting on location. No one noticed he was missing. <laughs> what? Poor Powers. Well, I suppose that explains that. Very well, Miss Vasquez. You may continue. I immediately called the police. Then Powers showed up. What was everyone else doing at that time? No one said a thing. It was silent. Completely silent. 
So we stood there until powers finally arrived on the scene. Sorry, sorry, I'm late. Then silence, dead silence. What the fuck? <laughs> what, you mean like right now? <laughs> Silent. Hey, hey Nick. Why is everyone so quiet? Someone should do something to lighten things up. <laughs> Security lady Oldbeck was quite agitated, pointing at Power saying he did it. Oldbeck? The security lady? Why did the security lady think Powers had done it? She said because she saw him going toward the studio. Right, the steel samurai. Did the detective arrest Mr. Powers based solely on the security lady's word? Perhaps not. She seems to have also given the detective that photograph. Of course I heard all this after the fact. That photograph, meaning the one taken by the security camera. She's not known for exhibiting the best sense of judgment when it comes to Hammer. Hmm, I don't think there's anything in there I can use. I asked to be left out of the proceedings. You asked to be left out? Yes. It seemed that everyone else was questioned, and I'm really not fond of that sort of thing. But you can't just decide who the police will and won't question. Thankfully, the studio thinks otherwise. They were nice enough to understand that since we were in a meeting, that there was no way we could have been involved. Thus, they covered for us. Covered for you, or covered it up for you? There must have been a lot writing on it with all those bigwigs at the meeting. I'm sure her professionals helped convince everyone that they didn't require questioning. I went back to the trailer to get my script and direction notes. The script and your direction notes? Yes, they're quite valuable. It wouldn't do, do to have them stolen. No, I guess not. Wait a second. I thought you came to Studio One for a rehearsal. Why didn't you bring your script and notes? Well, I was under the impression that we wouldn't be able to rehearse anything. Why? There was a murder after all. Who could think of rehearsing after that? Oh yeah, I guess. Hmm, very well. Miss Vasquez, please continue. Aha, uh -huh, what the? Your Honor, I have an objection to the witness's last statement. Huh? Think, Miss Vasquez says she didn't bring the script because there wouldn't be a rehearsal. Don't you see what that means? She would have had to know about the murder before going to Studio One. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Rumble, rumble, rumble! What the hell? Order, order! Miss Ed Mr. Edgeworth! What you just said is a reasonable observation. However, I find it hard to understand why the prosecution would make such a move. Or are you thinking of a career change to defense? I appreciate the concern, Your Honor. I will stand by my statement, however, regardless of how the court sees my role here. Now, Miss Vasquez, do you have an explanation? I can't believe Edward is helping me. Huff. So the prosecution is in cahoots with the defense? What kind of court is this? No matter. I think you misunderstood me. I had a perfectly good reason to believe there would be no rehearsal. Mm -hmm. Very well. The witness will change her testimony to reflect this reason. I knew that Hammer was injured and couldn't do any action scenes, so I left them behind. How'd you know about the injury? How did I know? Sal, he told me. Sal, the director? Hmm. You have to find something to peg this on her here. Or everything we've done until now will have been wasted. I believe in you, Nick. Go get him. Alright. I was with Sal and Obag the security leader when we found the body. The assistant was there too. Only Powers was absent. I immediately called the police. Then Powers showed up. The security leader Obag was quite agitated, pointing at Powers saying he did it. I asked to be left out of the proceedings. I went back to the trailer to get my script and direction notes. I knew that Hammer was injured and couldn't do any action scenes, so I left behind. Huh. was injured and couldn't do any action scenes, so I left them behind. She claims she figured it, she heard it from Sal. What the fuck? Again, it's not clear. It's not clear what the hell. Well, that's wrong. 
It was fleshed out for a reason, you know? How'd you know? Sal told me. Sal the director. Uh, fuck! There's good direction out. So I left them behind. Maybe the photo? I'm gonna try the photo. 